Okay. Hello there, Collective. Welcome back to my platform. So just to be <laughs> honest, I started doing this read and then some like weird energy kind of took over and they say, oh, you don't feel like doing your read today. Say, like, no, I do feel like doing my read. Be gone. Thank you. I absolutely do feel like doing my read. I don't know what the heck that was. So I was doing the read and then the energy was just weird. So I stopped it and started over. Um, and I like to be honest. So I do, I did already do a little bit of a reading on this spread. Um, but because I was not feeling the energy that was coming off of it, it just sounded so draggy and just so lame and just so like, not positive. I would say, no, that is not me. Like, we're going to start this over. So please excuse me. Uh, let's go ahead and see what in the name of source is going on here. There's a king of cups that's going through some type of recovery. This person could also just be coming up with a plan on how to come towards you. Star C, as you can see, we have the Knight of pentacles out here. So this person may want to invest in you, give you some type of financial offer. So you can have some type of brand new passionate beginning in life and things like that. Start off new. This person is extremely logical they see you as someone logical as well so there could have been something where people told them you were mentally unstable emotionally unstable but aren't we all <laughs> at some point uh, at some level we're all that aren't we anyways this person is still choosing to come towards you this person is making a decision um, because the universe has stepped in to make this go in your favor. Whatever people have been trying to hide from you, block you from, this is your divine inheritance and your ancestors are stepping in to make sure that you receive what is yours. You have a lot of beautiful opportunities coming in and this is because you are someone extremely innovative. This is what this King of Cups sees about you. They see that you are someone logical, someone honest, someone decisive, someone intellectual. You are a angelic as well someone knows that you are heavily protected and and things of that nature and you are business savvy as well so they know that you are great at multitasking you are innovative you're always coming up with new ideas and things of that nature there could have been something where maybe people were stealing ideas from you but this king of cups is finding out that you are the brains behind everything and so they may want to give you an opportunity so that you can manifest some type of new reality for yourself for some of you this has to do with a law of connection as you can see we have the two of uh, cups out here so you and this masculine may end up pairing together to manifest some type of new reality this person wants to speak their truth to you right um this person sees that you were maybe a uh, um uh, 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 I don't know what the word is that I want to use, but you were at a disadvantage because of actions people possibly took against you. Um, this person is also being get kept gatekeeping is something that's very heavy around them and you yourself and that's because people just don't want the two of you coming together there is some type of resource that you are supposed to have a hold of some type of financial payout abundance things of that nature and people are doing things behind the scenes to block that from you right and this king of cups may be kind of over it uh, this person may be getting out of a relationship as well to kind of start off brand new. This person may be in some type of superficial relationship where it's just not fulfilling for him and he's deciding to move on with his life. Um, it's like maybe he's been with someone that's very financially focused. He himself is showing up as being financially motivated like a uh, uh he overindulges in uh the final things in life, right? Because we have that four of pentacles out here followed by the eight. I mean, the nine of cups. This is someone that overindulges. Um, this could also be someone that even though they have the final things in life, they may be pinching pennies, but yet they still tend to overindulge in things, even though they should be managing their wealth a little bit more better, right? So this is like someone that maybe just has enough to maintain their, their, uh, basic living, like pay the bills and things like that, but don't really have extra to splurge but they will still go and splurge. That's the kind of behavior this person is in. For some of you, this masculine knows that you are in a tight situation when it comes to finances and things like that. And he wants to come in and speak the truth to you about this abundance that is yours or this opportunity that he wants to give you. Uh, and he knows that this is going to put you in a fine of energy where you, where you can live a little bit more easier. You don't have to work hard anymore, things like that. Um, someone here struggles with a lot of uh, confidence issues. 
right? So this could be a king of cups that presents himself well on the outside, but on the inside, he may deal with a lot of confidence issues and things like that. So maybe he has some hard experiences growing up and those experiences maybe um, mess with his confidence. So this is someone when you see them, they are well put together, but internally they're struggling just like the rest of us. Uh, so this is what that we have to do with. Um, someone received some type of bad news and this led to them kind of having to walk away from their situation, maybe a relationship, maybe families, friends, and things like that. Someone is walking away from a lot in order to have a new beginning in life. Someone may be flying, uh, someone may be traveling somewhere as well uh, to meet with you or to uh, just kind of have a new start in life. Like maybe someone is leaving one state or leaving one country to go to another so that they can start over, right? Because maybe they're not confident that things are going to get better where they are. Things are just too chaotic for them. So they are moving on to start over. Um, this person is standing their ground. It's that like you're trying to leave a situation, but people keep trying to manipulate you into staying in that situation, trying to tell you that, hey, if you go there, this is going to happen. If you go there, that's going to happen. If you get with this person, they're going to do this to you. But the whole time, the people that are telling you not to go are the very people that are either stealing from you or blocking you in some way. Some way. They're gatekeeping you and blocking you from it actual opportunities that are meant to prosper you, right? This masculine, there is some type of court case going on with some of you and this person is being advised to stand their ground. Someone could be defending some of you behind the scenes and you don't know it. So this person is taking a lot of hate hit for you. Um, so this is what's going on as well. For some of you, this masculine, I love how the eight of cups came out here. Um, right before this car uh, for the stand your ground right so this person is going on an emotional journey where he's having to find a higher meaning in life and you see like the beautiful transition he goes from being superficial to being someone with high moral character so he's someone that's about to be solid as a rock and that's because there's some type of awakening that this person went through uh seeing the truth about the lifestyle that he has been living and what type of changes he needs to make so that he can be someone of high moral character someone that is not a pushover someone that is confident and things like that and that's going to enable him to close this chapter and start over brand you right um there is something about a relationship or family maybe he's getting out of a relationship in order to come towards you or he's ending a relationship with a queen of cups in order to move on with his life maybe this person sees you as a higher level soulmate um and that this union was stolen from him because people misguided him in the past i don't know things like that kind of just confuse me it's like you're if you cannot think for yourself you cannot really blame other people for what you feel to do. This is why we have to be able to self-actualize for ourselves. Um, but maybe this person wants to start over brand new and have a relationship with you, but we have the 10 of cups out here in the reverse. So it's quite possible that it may be too late for him to partner up with you. Um, you have a higher level soulmate that is coming in and this is someone that's with the BS. This is someone that wants to have a brand new passionate beginning with you in love. So maybe the opportunity between you and this King of Cups is just not happening because this person did not take the right actions in the past to solidify their position with you. Um, so you are being granted a new relationship with a higher level soulmate, right? Um, this person is a little bit outside of the box, just like yourself. So you two will, uh, um, will get along just fine, right? The only thing is that one of you may be a little bit more on the religious side of thing, while the other one is a little bit more spiritual. Um, but you two will have to find a way to balance this out, right? So this new passionate beginning in love is going to enable the both of you to move forward. Someone wants to invest in you, but they are extremely worried that you are not going to want to talk to them, not wanting to fix things with them. Someone is having a lot of anxiety, 
right? Because the truth is seen about you. You are someone that's balanced, not mentally unstable, not emotionally unstable, not someone chaotic. Someone is having a lot of nightmare because this offer is still coming towards you, right? Someone is losing their SHIT because you are receiving what is yours. You're showing up here as the page of pentacles, meaning you are someone that invests in what matters to you, energy and things like that. Uh, effort, time, finance, you will invest in what matters to you and you will nurture that until it becomes what it is that you dreamed it to be. And someone is having a lot of nightmare and anxiety about this because they know if you receive this offer, you are going to be prospering in life and they won't be a part of it. And this is either someone from your past or people from your past or people that you may not even know that have been interfering with this. Okay. Um, so you are being advised to keep pushing forward regardless of what's going on with you. And this is what some of these masculines are doing as well. Um, push forward, garner your strength, no matter how hard it is, no matter what's going on, push forward. You will be successful in business. Uh, you're going to be having a lot of connections with people, um, places and things that is going to be extremely abundant for you. This decision that has been made for you to receive your abundance Someone is in some type of distress about this. Like it has something to do with them. It's like someone, it's like you're receiving what belongs to you, but someone is pissed off or broken about it. But it's like it was never yours in the first place. Okay. Some of you, you are guiding this masculine without even knowing it. It's like the way you carry yourself, the way you talk, whatever it is you're doing for a living. You could be working with this person in a company and not even know it. Uh, you could be on social media. Um, the, whatever it is you're doing in some way, shape or form, some of you are guiding this person to the truth. Um, and it's extremely beautiful because sometimes that's what you need is that your counterpart helping you unknowingly, because if they find out the truth about what you are, who you are, it can complicate things a little bit more. So sometimes it's best for you to not know who your soulmate is while you are helping them unknowingly. Right. Um, so you're going to be receiving your abundance, which is going to allow you to be a little bit more authentic with yourself, uh, live in your truth. You, you're showing up here as a wise energy. Right. Um, so this is extremely beautiful. The truth is being seen about you. You are someone extremely wise. Someone may have sought counsel about you on how to move forward with you. And you're going to be partnering up with a emperor in here for some of you. So this is absolutely beautiful. This is like an emperor that is not easy to be mended. So you see like this king of cups, people were able to manipulate this king of cups in turning into uh, turning away from you. But with the emperor, the, the energy is a little bit more sturdy. You can't just tell an emperor, hey, that person is this. And then the emperor just goes off of that. Like they have to do their own research behind the scenes, find the truth out before they can make a decision about who it is you're talking to or talking about, right? So they like to find out things for themselves in order to make a move, right? And that's how it's supposed to be. Uh, there's, there's something about an institution approaching an emperor. They could have maybe told this emperor a lot of lies, tried to mislead this person, but this person is seeing the truth for what it is. This is someone that is protected, right? This emperor could have gone to maybe a practitioner to get the truth, maybe to a counselor. Uh, I don't know. They went to, to seek some type of legal advice or just proper advice from another person. And they are choosing to collaborate with you and bring justice and balance into a situation, right? And this is absolutely amazing because this is like a complete stranger doing what's right by you, even though they don't know you. Whereas people you've been aware of, people you've been around, people you know, and things of that nature, choose to undercut you, choose to betray you, choose to block you and things like that. There's some type of news that's being blocked from coming towards you, um, but it will make it to you when it's supposed to. So don't you worry. It's like someone is sending you a message, but people are blocking it. And this person is going to end up coming in person to give you the message when they're supposed to, as it was always meant to be, right? And there's nothing people can do to block that. It's going to happen exactly when it's supposed to happen, okay? So don't sit around, you know, worry about when am I going to receive this? Am I going to receive this? Why is it not coming? Like if you start doing things like that, it will start to kind of drag your energy down and things like that, and you don't want that, okay? 
So there's a, a person, this King of Cups, that was making this plan to come towards you. For some of you, you're going to have to decide if you want to be with them or not. Um, but for some of you, this union with them is just not happening because this is not someone that had enough strength or courage to stand up for themselves and speak on your behalf when you were not around. Uh, and sometimes, you know, the universe is testing our character. The universe is testing our morals. Like, are you going to do the right thing even though you have a hundred people coming up against you? Are you going to stand your ground and tell the truth? Speak on the behalf of this person because you know the truth about this person. Uh, are you going to follow your intuition? Sometimes the universe is just testing you to see how you're going to do something, if you're going to do something before they can bless you with the next big opportunity or blessing in life. And it looks like this King of Cups may have failed. Um, and he's now having to learn some type of lesson that could have been avoided. Um, but sometimes that's how life is too, right? Um, this is how we learn. This is part of karma. This is part of incarnating, learning the lessons we need to learn. Maybe if he had not failed, he wouldn't be learning this lesson. But in the future, he probably will not be repeating the same thing because when someone comes to him and tells him something about another character he wants to work with, he's going to find the truth out about him that person just like this emperor did, right? You are about to be living in your privileged energy. You're taking charge of your life. You are self-reliant. Uh, you are like also showing up as the emperor in your life. You're laying down the law. You're not BSing around with people. Uh, you're kind of tired with the BS because it's like everywhere you go, people around you are turning out to be wolves and just financially motivated like doing things to you about financial opportunities that a lot of you may not even be aware of right but because people don't want you accepting or receiving that they've been doing things to block you right um, but you are going to have justice you will have uh, the outcome that is in your favor anyway stay blessed